Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Lucky Sam and welcome to today's video. Yes, finally guys, we are doing the RRR director breaks down the Oscar winning Natu Natu scenes. Let's see how this video goes and yeah, actually this video was recommended and I'm going to put the name of the person here. Shout out to you for recommending this video for me. Thank you so much for recommending it. Without further ado, let's just go straight into the video. I must have seen this song many, 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 many times. I sometimes yeah. watch it on YouTube or uh, go to uh, Instagram, uh, the streaming TikTok. platforms and watch the song again. I was worried that I wouldn't give you the notes and I myself will keep watching this song again. I like this song. Guys, will you believe me that I watched the movie yesterday and I was so emotional, like, I now understand, like, it's so crazy. I watched the movie, I was so freaking inspired and, wow, ah, let's just continue it. Let's just continue. Hello, this is SS Raj Mauli. I'm the director of a Telugu language Indian film, RRR, and I'm so happy to be here to give you the notes on the scene, notes on the song, Natu Natu. The first thing, that comes to me when uh, when we talk about uh, Natu Natu is the location itself. It was shot in Kiev, actually the presidential palace. This was actually supposed to happen oh. in India, but because it was monsoon time then, so we were trying to look scout the locations and we found this and I really loved it. And then they told me it's the presidential palace. I thought, oh, maybe Ooh. then I have to look for another location. But they said, no, 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 this is Ukraine, you can get uh, uh, the job done. Wow. I'm so thankful for the Ukrainian team. The colors of the palace, the size of the palace, the size of the ground for the dancers to be there was the exact uh, uh, right size. Because we are talking about Kyiv, the, the beautiful thing about the song uh, that many tend not to notice are the background uh, dancers. If you look here, the bunch here, all of them are not extras, all of them are dancers. And if you can see how Whoa. the men are not comfortable with this, Whoa. two Indian guys taking uh, their scene the, over, yeah. the girls are really, really enjoying the steps. You can see all of them are perfectly enacting the scene before their turn comes when they have to wow. dance. I was really, really surprised that the level of professionalism the dancers there uh, in Ukraine had, uh, really loved working with them. It's a choreographer, uh, Prem Rakshit. He has worked with me before, he has worked with Charan before, he has worked with Tarak before. He gave one of the most memorable numbers for both of them. He knows their style, wow. exactly what their body language is. He exactly knows what their fans expect out of them. Here he has a very difficult job because here both the actors have to dance together. Each of them have their own style, but he has to find out a style mm -hmm. which will suit both of them as a dancing style, which would be not complicated yeah, because yeah, I also yeah, wanted yeah, yeah, yeah. to uh, figure out steps which people would like to uh, Hop do on for it. themselves. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. it should be nice. It shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, it should suit the style of both the actors and it should be fantastic. Quite a number of instructions and uh, he has come up with, uh, you wouldn't believe it, more than 100 variations for this 3-4 signature. Wow. Na to na to na to na to for that line. I remember he sent me the video, it was going on and on and on and on. And I had difficult time picking up the best 3-4 variations for this style. Uh, so the first credit. Prem Rakshit. I've had enough of this nonsense. You two out. No, Jake. I've had enough of your bullying. Oh, oh, hey, oh. Go. <laughs> this for me is the uh, this is, is insane. The best, uh, a step in the entire song. The costume designer Rama, who also happens to be my wife, she didn't give the costumes like a. Wow, your wife is a costume designer. This is insane. Wow. Like a song because it was supposed to be a scene. She gave the costume like a scene, and when Prem saw the dress and he saw the suspenders, he said, "Can I 
can I uh, use the uh, suspenders? She said, okay, he composed a couple of steps and he said, uh, if the suspenders are too tight, they can't be doing it so easily. It has to be a little bit loose for the dance step. Uh, so it was Prem's idea to bring the uh, suspenders in. And the funny thing is like, they had the loose suspenders only for this particular shot. Before and after it were tight suspenders. And just in the before shot, when Jenny, oh. she pulls the suspenders and leaves it and says, go. The suspenders were actually the tight suspenders and I crossed their chest and they had a wince on their face, but they were smiling <laughs> until I said cut. And the moment I said cut, they were like walking away in pain. Wow. Even for them, it was, this was the most difficult uh, uh, step, doing wow. all the uh, things on the top, the suspenders moving and sliding. Right foot also has to go to the side and come as they are sliding. Wow, I look at the foot! The genius of the uh, This is insane! When I instructed him, I told him, yes, for the audience, this is a song, this is fun, they are dancing and everything. But for the story, it is actually a fight scene because yeah, it yeah, starts yeah. off with a uh, on a on a bad note. Yes, and yes, yeah. guy is coming and insulting them, humiliating them. But yeah, both yeah. of them are there on a purpose. They cannot really fist fight. Do a fist fight. And so dance fight. Yeah, 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 it yeah. I watched the movie. It was insane. You are seeing a song. You are seeing a dance. But effective, in effect, you are getting the the emotion of a fight. So that's the instruction that I gave uh, Prem. That's what I needed. You see their body language, how they're standing, mm. how their their uh, body movement is. It looks like a fight. That's how brilliant Prem is. Sindhil, my cinematographer, I worked. This is my eighth film with him. Initially, mm. he shows me what kind of tone that he's looking at for this particular film. He'll give me two or three references. And then I don't meddle with the lighting or, or the tonality of, of the film. My production designer, Sabu, he had a, a lot of idea on how colonial India was, um, what the properties were, what the costume colors were. He had a lot of idea, so he was really uh, rushing through queue to find the right kinds of wow and this is this literally insane sabu was sitting there with the art director there and he was particularly telling this color this color should come at the bottom this color should come at wow, the top. And wow. he was uh, really uh, putting all wow. his effort uh, uh, into it and sindhil was there to look at so i don't look at uh, at that at all uh, my job is to see whether my actors are doing the step the correct way that I want to, their expression is perfect or not. That's the only job uh, I look at it. We are shooting in the presidential uh, palace, like I said, and here is the parliament. <laughs> parliament of <Wow. laughs> in Ukraine. I was so shocked. Uh, I, I asked my line producer uh, there, is it okay to shoot a song in a full volume right by the side of the wow in front of the wow. palace. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No go ahead <laughs> wow this is insane wow wow next to the parliament house <laughs> only thing is it will be in in actual metallic in color in post we made it like a lime plastered one more point is all the uh, background musicians who are holding the clarinets the violins and all that stuff they are also actual musicians i wanted them Ooh. to be musicians because they hold the violin properly they hold the clarinet properly and all that i asked anna is that okay can i place the uh, musicians there is it okay for for them to just stand there and act not actually play Ah, okay, no problem. Go ahead. <laughs> this is the step which was like on, on TikTok. Or Yo, I'm freaking social media overwhelmed right now. Wow. Everyone was trying to do, whether it's friends, brothers, mother and daughter, uh, husband and wife. Everyone were uh, uh, doing the step and posting on the uh, yeah, social media. Yeah, 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 yeah. went viral and helped yeah, the film yeah, 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 gain the popularity. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like that 
effect. I mean, it's it's not new. It has been used um, many times. Many times, the yeah. Goes forward and yeah, 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 yeah. So the they zoom back. Yeah, yeah. Not playing the full frame, but the background really comes forward. Is it the dolly zoom? I think that's how it's called. Around, uh, but it was we are losing uh, the essence of the step. So we use mm -hmm. uh, uh, this one. Just track forward and and zoom. Yeah. Back. <laughs> This is wow. where the nightmare started for it's the <laughs> costumers. From uh, a solid ground, we moved on to a place where it was dusty. dusty. I wanted the dust to fly, but the costumes were made with such a delicate material, and we were making them do this the natuna to step. In the in dust. dust. <laughs> With this dress, and the dress were getting really, dirty. really dirty and spoiled. The costumers had to make two dresses, three dresses, and every day they had after the shoot they had to go and clean them very delicately. It's not that you can put them in a washing machine and take them out. They had to be hand cleaned properly. So after long wow. working hours of working eight hours a day, the costumers were taking the dresses and cleaning them properly and wow. doing it again. <laughs> I really like to go uh, lengthy takes. I, I don't like to cut in between. Uh, here I had a long discussion with my editor on having this this group coming into a formation. The the idea is like all the guys are with Jake. Wow, being a director is is so, like, so much. Like this so much crowd to separate into the girls coming behind. Ram and Beam and the boys coming behind Jake. It was clearly established in the in the in the top angle uh, shot. For me, it would have been nice if this entire thing was in one single shot. So you can see all the girls coming from the mixed position, and you see mm. from the mixed position all the boys going here. Oh. And at the same time, you see Jake is moving this way, and Ram and Beam are moving towards this way. It was very well uh, choreographed. But the editor said. The punch would be nice if we uh, cut it into three or four cuts. Well, sometimes even the director have to give in to your <laughs> Yeah. Wow, look at that. The energy. When I watched the movie, guys, I was like, wow, this is insane. <laughs> like, I was so surprised. Like, wow, the breakdown is making sense. Wow. I must have seen this song many, 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 many times, uh, not just on the editing table. Even after the release, I sometimes watch it on YouTube or uh, go to yeah, 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 uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's so crazy. And watch the song again. I watch the the background dancers. I become a fan of these guys. You can you can see they were they are really acting like pros. They are not just dancing, but they had to do the steps wrong sometimes, and they have to express that they are not doing it. Properly and properly, yeah. one by one. I like each and every dancer here. This guy, this guy, how they were performing. And you should also see the girls, how Jenny goes back and he pulls her again. The expressions, how the girls just wow. pass that. They're tired, but still uh, really, really enjoying it. This girl, I think it's a very beautiful frame by Sindhil. He got that dark yeah, yeah, yeah. in the foreground, whereas the action is happening in the background. One of the inspirations for wow, me for this nice. is, you know, is a completely different uh, thing. In Ten Commandments, when the sea is parting, there is a shot of three ladies watching what is happening in front of them. And the arrangement is like, wow. like, a, like a painting. This is not exactly like that, but a, a kind of inspiration is is from there. Wow. Wow. Guys, I don't know. I don't know, but I, I have a watery eye. You know, I don't know. Most of you wouldn't understand what he's talking about. Guys, my dream is to be a movie director. Seriously, I'm not going to lie. My dream is to be a movie director. And then hearing such, you know, inspirational, you know, things from this dude is making my eye watery right now. I don't know. Wow. <laughs> Very inspirational. Oh. And look at the guy's expression when Jake falls down. <laughs> These guys, yeah. absolutely perfect. Tarak and wow. are really <laughs> exceptionally uh, good dancers. I always feel dance is... My eyes are watery, I don't know why. <laughs> acrobatic 
you are, how perfectly you can uh, do your step. There are two important things. One is that you should really, really enjoy your dance. Only yeah. then can audience really get the enjoyment out of your your dance. And second yeah, thing yeah. is like in every moment of of the on the dance, you are conveying something to the audience, some kind of emotion. They really infused yes, 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 that, yes. Uh, that energy. Yeah, 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 yeah. That this guy is a one of a million, like a one of a million director giving it back to you. Quite a subtle yeah, yeah, and difficult. Yeah, yeah emotion to portray but these two guys nailed it nailed it yeah so the indians have won actually the story is over but we know that nt rama rao and ram sharan are two top heroes commercial heroes yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. would love to see them compete against each other each, each other dance, looking at each other like okay we defeated them what about you and me? You and me? <laughs> it was so crazy seeing this scene. That wow expression of Jenny is the best. There are countless wow. um, messages, memes, everything saying that the entire audience expression towards the song is exactly that. And when this shot was made, the dust really flew. Everyone in the unit were coming into the tent and like, Peeking in, looking in, can we say that again? Can we play this again? This was the shot that everyone really, really loved. She's rooting for Beam Akhtar at that uh, point of time, and he sees that Jenny is in love with Akhtar and he loses. Yeah. 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 Being his innocent self, he doesn't get it. He continues dances. And <laughs> so for me, Natu Natu, uh, one of the reasons why I think it is such a hit is not just because of the music, not just because of the dance. Yeah. Because there is the a emotion beautiful story attached. in itself. The yeah, entire yeah, yeah. story of RRR is within that 10 minutes of not not to lead 10 minutes uh, yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Song. nobody yeah, yeah, yeah. in america or across the world uh, really knows the meaning of the lyrics uh, but it is the catchiness of the the lyric yeah the yeah the, yeah the flow i even don't know the meaning of I the lyrics that is the credit should be given to uh, chandra bose uh, the lyricist we had a blast shooting it we had a blast enjoying the audiences having having the blast. wow thank you everyone wow for, uh, who has, who has wow involved. thank you for the breakdown thank you for the breakdown thank you for the breakdown i really enjoyed myself wow i can't believe that this got my eyes watery because you know i relate to things i want to be a you know film director one day and yeah <laughs> so it got me you know it really mm, it got me <laughs> Okay guys, if you enjoyed this video, I also enjoyed this video. I even, I nearly cried, I had my eyes were watery and I enjoyed myself and I believe you enjoyed this video. I want to say a big shout out to this person for recommending this video. I'm so happy for you recommending this video for me. I'm so happy. I'm so freaking motivated right now. I say God bless you. Other than that, it's been me, like you said. And you know how we're going to do it? I'm out. Peace.